Did the Nobel Prize winners in medicine accept their award wearing face masks? Certain social media users believe this means the pioneers behind the COVID vaccine don't even trust their own innovation. Let's get down to the truth behind this viral claim. This year's Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine has been awarded to Catalin Carrico and Drew Weissman for their work on mRNA vaccines, crucial to combat the spread of COVID-19. The same mRNA technology is now being researched for its application to other diseases, including cancer. However, according to some social media users, the award-winning scientists don't even trust their own technology because they're seen wearing face masks. Multiple ex-users claim the scientists think their own innovation is ineffective. So to check whether this is true or not, we took the viral photo and we did a reverse image search. We found the original one on Alamy, which is a stock photo website. The image was taken in April 2022, more than one year before the Nobel Prize announcement. The caption also says the photo was taken in Tokyo during the Japan Prize Ceremony, not in Sweden, where the Nobel Prize winners are decided. The Japan Prize is an annual event that awards pioneers in science and technology. And the country dropped the mask mandate pretty late compared to other nations around the world. In March 2023, the government dropped its recommendation to wear masks, so it is highly likely that in April 2022, during the ceremony, the award winners would still have been obliged to wear one. An official video of the Japan Prize 2022 shows that everyone present is seen covering their faces, not only Kariko and Weissman. The prize will be presented to Professor Kathleen Kariko and Professor Drew Weissman, who are awarded in the field of materials and production in 2022. Moreover, both scientists were seen celebrating their achievement at a press conference in the United States without a face covering when accepting the Nobel Prize this year. For more fact checks and investigations, check out our website, yournews.com.